Hey there! Okay, we are going to be creating a book using InDesign. This is a four print book, and I've actually started on a couple of um, iterations here, but I didn't have all of the um, copy yet, so this was just like layout. It's just so that the client, my friend, and um, partner in crime, I guess, Ms. Jana Moynihan, who's also a client, um, just so she can see how it looks. So this is all pretty much work that I did for I'm not going to be able to keep it. So anyway, she's happy with this layout. So now we are going to move forward with the final design. So I'm actually going to X out of that. I do not want to save those changes. And let's to, we're going to go to a new, oops, new, nah, sorry, document. Now, it sounds like you should do book because you're making a book, but you don't want to make a book. You're making a document. I know it sounds retarded, but this is just how it works. So, new document, and then you have to know, like, the size. So, we're not doing facing pages on this, um, just the way that the layout works for, um, for create space. If they don't like facing pages, you can always change it later if you need to. Um, I do want a primary text frame. That means that the text will actually be embedded into, like you can copy and paste basically, and it makes it a lot easier. And then for the page size, we are going to do, it says here, Jane is book. I don't have the settings actually saved correctly. So the book is going to be eight and a half by eight and a half inches. But because of bleed, which means like it needs to be a little bit bigger so they can cut it, it's actually going to be instead of eight and a half, it's going to be eight point. So I need to add 0 0.25, so eight point. So instead of eight point five, it's actually going to be eight point six five, right? Yes, because it adds fifteen um, point one five for so eight point six five, no eight point six five. That should be the same. Um, 8.65 inches and then automatically convert it to pica. Um, <clears throat> I know I want only one column. I know that only, uh, the gutter needs to be just one pica. That's fine. And then for the bleed and slug, it's actually going to be, um, the bleed is like how, like where they cut it. So it's 0.15, right? That's what we did. So it was 0.15. 0.85. Yes, so that should be right. And then I hit OK. So it's like generating this new document for me. Ta-da! So what you see here um, is actually the, um, see that red outline? That's actually like where your design needs to go to. Because that's where they're going to cut it, like when they cut the paper. So if you look at it like um, screen mode into bleed, it actually show you like where it bleeds off. But I do like to um, have my screen mode either on normal or on preview personally. So this is your um, text box that they've already put in there for you. We're going to be editing that in the next video um, to set this up for your chapters and verses as well as doing your master pages. But now you've got it set up to be able to start creating your document. Let me real quick before we move into the next training kind of talk about some of these controls. You won't be using all of these, and you'll just kind of learn it as you go, which is, in my opinion, the best way to learn anything. But um, the, the main um, tools you're going to be using are your pages, which are right here. So this sometimes is hidden. You can always just click on pages to get that out. Um, your layers. I do use the character and the paragraph, all four of these, pretty regular. So um, depending on how you're setting up your book for print, you may or may not need all of these other design tools. I do recommend that before you um, get started, if you are using anything in color, go ahead and write down like the color codes that you're going to need because um, it's just easier that way with InDesign and um, any other images that you're going to need, like your logos or whatever, just have those ready and you can actually just place these right into this file. So I'll see you on the next one.